It's a, a main initiative of the Naval History and Heritage Command to make Navy's history accessible and relevant to the sailors of today. And so we support that by um, undertaking our, our conservation and research of the Navy's history. There are significant challenges um, with the artifacts that are recovered. You have the simple fact that they have been waterlogged for between 50 and 250 years uh, adds another dimension of complexity to uh, their treatment. The Hell Torpedo is a late 19th century uh, torpedo that was the first really automotive steam-powered torpedo of American design. Number 24 came to the Naval History and Heritage Command in May of 2013. This is a, a really rare and unique artifact. It's a true privilege to, to be able to work on this project and to work in such close proximity to a very tangible piece of the Navy's history. The gentlemen that are working on the torpedo today are doing a 3D laser scanning of the torpedo, uh, both the after body and the middle body. The benefit of using technology like this really helps us, the archaeologists and conservators, understand the topography of the entire artifact. It can show features, important features, like serial numbers, maker's marks, things that aren't necessarily immediately visible to the naked eye, and um, help us to uh, understand also some of the physical things that have happened to the torpedo throughout its, uh, its history, potentially even help us maybe understand the reasons for its loss. To be able to take it from a state where, if left untreated, it would almost certainly continue to corrode and uh, deteriorate to a stable state where it can be uh, displayed and appreciated and researched is, is a real honor.